Hello Aries, welcome to your bonus love reading, Sun, Moon, Rising and Venus. Let's see what messages will show up for you today. Aries, this is a collective love message for your sign. So please take it how it resonates and what resonates for your overall situation. Let's see. Let's see Aries. So, um, Aries, we are connecting here in this reading with someone who has a plan. They are quite strategic, okay? I feel this person also is very curious about you, but the, it feels like they are planning here something. They're planning their next move, essentially, uh, towards you. We have crush. It feels here that this person has a crush on you. They are falling in love with you. They are very attracted to you. There is something here about them losing sleep over this situation as well. Um, there is something that needs to be worked through though between the two of you. It's like there is no um, coincidence here that both of you met. That's what I am getting very strongly. Yeah, when it comes to your energy, Aries, I feel that when you met this person, it was that instant spark instant connection this person brought excitement uh, to your love life yeah i feel that you are very attracted to this person mutual energy we have suspicious that's interesting um <laughs> i feel that both of you are quite curious about each other um I'm, that's what i am getting here is that I'm not getting 100% maybe maybe that's the case for some of you but energetically I feel that you are just curious about each other you have many many questions and it's like you know you might be suspecting that this person might have options in love if that's the case that's a mutual energy for some of you I'm getting very strongly here that you are mirroring each other. Maybe it's very difficult to read this person, you know, Aries, and you kind of think, mm, I'm wondering what's going to be their, their next move. When it comes to this person, I feel that they are planning here to ask you something. It's like they want to figure out something. Um, they want to get some sort of answer here. Yeah. Let's see. Let's see what is this all about. Could you please show me this person's energy and feelings towards Aries and this connection, please? Four of Cups, Queen of Wands. Ace of Wands. Could you please show me this person's energy and feelings towards this? Could you please show me this person's energy and feelings towards Aries and this connection, please? Oh, wow. Okay. We have Page of Wands, the Lovers. This person wants only your attention. And it's like they want your attention to be focused on them. You might be dealing with Gemini. Yeah, Gemini we have so far in this reading for you. Eight of Pentacles, King of Pentacles and Four of Swords as an overall energy for their part of the reading. Four of Cups, Queen of Wands. This person sees you as someone who is incredibly attractive. You know, they are very drawn to you. And that's what I am getting, that constant kind of chemistry attraction between the two of you. But this is someone who is assuming that there might be someone else. That you might be, you know, that this is someone who feels that your focus is not fully directed on them. That's the thing. 
and with the four of cups it's like it's not working for this person this person wants you to be fully fully focused on them and them only and here is the thing i feel this person with this energy will try to figure out if indeed there is some if they have some sort of competition mm -hmm. we have an ace of wands page of wands this person wants to be in touch with you they want to talk with you we have the lovers and three of pentacles they want to work with you to be in a relationship this person wants to be with you aries with the lovers and three of pentacles they feel like you know both of you can work on this connection but expect action from this person with the ace of wands and page of wands action communication there will be a conversation here about someone else or it's like this person will try to figure out if indeed there is someone else in a sense if they have some sort of competition if someone is interested in you or it might be you know the reason why they might be thinking that way for instance if you have social media someone might have liked your photos or your post or it's like this person repeatedly repeatedly the other person is liking what you're posting and this person feels that someone else is interested in you and it's like they want reassurance that you are not interested in them so essentially you have someone here who wants to know if they have competition mm -hmm. they are very passionate about this connection this person feels so much attraction they have so much attraction for you eight of pen you might be working with this person for some of you aries oh it's like someone this so, somehow this person is connected with your work related situation because we have three of pentacles eight of pentacles king of pentacles that's that can be employment working related kind of environment or you were introduced by someone from your work to this person four of swords yeah it's like this person will be showing you that they care they will be putting an effort because i i'm getting some this person is going to talk a lot they're going to talk a lot about this connection and it's like they will be talking a lot about their expectations that they are looking for a serious relationship with the king of pentacles four of swords yeah um i'm seeing them you know it's like this person has a very kind of a distinctive way of holding a conversation I'm not seeing them one kind of, you know, asking you questions directly. It's like they are talking about something, they're expressing their views and they are assuming here that you're going to uh, provide some sort of commentary on this, you know, or you present your point of view. Yeah, something like this. Because four of swords, it's a passive energy. For some of you, Aries if this person hasn't been in touch for like four days or you feel like they withdraw or, or you feel like you know that communication ha hasn't been that intense as it used to be that's going to change because I see so much action okay so they will be in touch for some of you this person will say oh I've been sorry I've been very busy because I had so much things to uh, I had so much work to to do regarding my you know work related situation or something that they've been working on let's see let's see Aries let's see your perspective could you please show me Aries's energy and feelings towards this person and this connection please we have the hanged man You please show me Eris's energy and feelings towards this person and this connection, please. Four of Swords, uh huh. Five of Cups, Queen of Cups, Knight of Cups, and Justice. Three of Cups, King of Wands, and King of Cups. Okay. 
you do share very strong soul connection with this person. We have King of Cups and Queen of Cups. King of Wands and Queen of Wands. Yeah, it's like, like a double confirmation that you might be dealing here with your soulmate. It's like a pair. You know, this is a match. I'm not seeing you taking any action though. Uh, you might be dealing with Libra. We also have Pisces here so far in this reading for you. Of course, cross watches, the roles can be reversed. And Aries, if I haven't mentioned a person sign of Zodiac, but you, resi but you resonate with this reading, that's your message. So we have the Hanged Man, Four of Swords. Yeah, it's like, this is a passive energy. Five of Cups, Queen of... This person saddened you. It's like they disappointed you, Aries. And you are not taking here any action. I feel that you are in kind of a... Looking at the situation from a different perspective, but I'm, I'm seeing you refusing to communicate with this person or take action. Knight of Cups. There is something here about with the justice. It's like this person owes you some sort of apology. You want them to come forward and apologize, explain themselves. You might feel like this person needs to balance things out with you because they handle something situate they handle something here without fairness and 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 justice. It's I feel, I'm getting here that this person might have judged you or it's like it feels that way. And it's just not okay. Something here you might feel like it's not okay and you refuse to take action. And I feel this person really saddened you with their actions or was something that was said. I feel that you still has feelings for them big time, but um, I feel that you want them to come forward and express regret that they've handled certain situation in a certain way. And I feel that you want to see them trying to balance things out with you indeed. Mm -hmm. Three of Cups, King of Wands, King of Cups. For some of you, you might be feeling that someone here got involved, like a friend of theirs, and they kind of, you know, planted that seed of doubt. And you, f and you feel like, why this person would say something like this? You know, I, 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 there is something here that you disliked, that you fundamentally disagreeing with. And it might involve this person, it's like, they friend got involved, they kind of, you know, they said something or they tried to advise them or something like this. I feel that you want this person to, to come forward, to explain themselves, to take responsibility here for something that was indeed said or done. Could you please show me the outcome? Well, that's interesting. Really interesting. Let's see. Five of Wands. Knight of Swords. And Ten of Swords. Eight of Pentacles, King of Cups, Two of Swords, High Priestess, King of Pentacles, Queen of Pentacles, and the Two of Cups. Oh my gosh. Wow. Oh my gosh. So we already ha had King and Queen of Wands, King and Queen of Cups. Now we have King of Pentacles with the Queen of Pentacles together with the Two of Cups. Wow. Aries. You might be dealing with Pisces, with Cancerian energy, Scorpio. Um, we have Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn as well here. So this person here is coming with the energy of Five of Wands, Knight of Swords and Ten of Swords. I'm seeing them trying to make things right with you. Um, 
with the five of wands yeah there is something here about competition that this person might be suspecting that there might that, that that they they might have competition okay but five of wands also suggests here that they've created a tension between the two of you well knight of swords suggests that they 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 going to this person is going to be in touch with you this is a chaser uh, card so this person is going to chase you because uh, with the Ten of Swords, Ten of Swords in in this context of this reading suggests that this person knows that there is nothing much more that they can do. They are surrounding to the circumstances and the fact that they need to take action in order to resolve the situation in the best possible way. Because your energy is very straightforward here. I don't see you taking any action. I see you being quite disappointed with something that's been said or assumed. So... I can see here this person trying to make things right, trying to find a positive resolution and trying to heal that tension that might be between the two of you. Mm -hmm. Because there is no other choice. So they're going to chase your mutual energy. We have an eight of pentacles. It might be a case that indeed uh, this is someone from your workplace or someone somehow connected with your work-related matters, but this is uh, an effort. This person is going, it's, they will try to show you that they care, they will be putting an effort in this situation. We have a King of Cups, Two of Swords, the High Priestess. Interesting. That's your energy and also three final cards for your outcome. Um, I feel that you want this person to be more emotionally vulnerable with you. Uh, you might find yourself at the crossroads with the two of swords but I feel that uh, yeah I'm seeing you you know kind of keeping your cards very close to your chest with the high priestess and listening to your intuition king of pentacles queen of here is the thing I don't see this connection ending at all actually I see both people being in a relationship because King of Pentacles with the Queen of Pentacles, this is a match. This is two people being together in a relationship and we have a Two of Cups here. It feels here that whatever is happening between the two of you, uh, the, the outcome shows that it is very likely that actually both of you will be in a relationship. It's like a little bit, I'm getting that energy of destiny very strongly here. And, you know, that suspicious, that energy of being suspicious as a mutual energy. Yeah, I, I, I feel what I'm getting here, Aries, is as this person might have misjudged the situation. They said something, someone might have got in the middle and they kind of metaphorically saying whispered something to their ear. And they plant that seed of doubt. Okay. And it's like this person is assuming that there is someone else. And you might feel or you found out about this that made you really, really uh, unhappy that they've assumed something like this. And you feel that, you know, they need to come forward and, and, and essentially balance things out with you. But I feel this is like a situation. It's not about the whole connection. I feel that whole connection there is something here about this mutual attraction. Um, I feel that this person has feelings for you big time. They want to be with you. They care a lot about you. And for some of you, this connection might be relatively new. That's why it's like this energy of being su suspicious. It's. I feel that both of you still, I'm going to stand with this. I feel that there are many questions. You are quite curious about each other. And you want to get those answers and but main thing here is that I feel that recently something happened between the two of you and it's like it's a little bit awkward and indeed someone might got involved and this person needs to put an effort if they want to change the circumstances between the two of you but it doesn't mean that love it's not there and it doesn't mean that you cannot overcome that 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 um, kind of you know situation quite uh, you know the cards here are showing that actually it is very likely that both of you will be together aries 
with this King of Pentacles, Queen of Pentacles and Two of Cups, that everything will be okay. So stay positive. I see this person uh, reaching out to you and trying to explain themselves. Aries, I will leave it here. Thank you so, so very much for being with me. Please like, share and subscribe. And once again, thank you very much for your time. I truly, truly appreciate you. Aries, have a fantastic and absolutely gorgeous day. And once again, thank you very much for being with me. I am sending you much, much love. Till next time, take care. Bye.